trundles on with a relatively light release schedule, as this week sees Capcom's Wii exclusive Monster Hunter Tri make a splash at retailers and precious little else. Monster Hunter Tri brings the series' familiar gameplay formula to a new platform, as players are tasked with hunting a variety of monsters across various environments, with Capcom introducing underwater levels for this latest installment. The game supports both Wii Remote and Nunchuck controls, as well as the traditional Classic Controller Gamepad and the Classic Controller Pro, which also launches this week. The game will be available on its own for $50 or in a bundle with a black Classic Controller Pro for $60. Those wanting the controller but not the game will be able to buy it a la carte in white and black versions for $20. If Monster Hunter Tri isn't one's cup of tea, then the week's new release schedule for retail games looks pretty light. The PSP edition of Blood Bowl is expected to make its belated debut in stores. Unfortunately, a handful of notable downloadable titles are also scheduled to arrive to feed gamers new release appetites. 2K Play's Pie Thieving Puzzler The Misadventures of PB Winterbottom will make its downloadable debut on the PC, while Sega's arcade remake Afterburner Climax takes off on the Xbox Live Arcade and PlayStation Network this week. For further details on the week's games, visit GameSpot's new releases page. Release dates are based on retailer listings and are subject to change. <laughs>